Today we compare my favorite Euro game Terra Mystica to its younger sibling, brother, sister, whatever you want, Terra Nova. What's up everybody, welcome to the life of a board gamer. My name is Daniel and today we are doing one of these comparison videos. Today we are going to talk about Terra Mystica. Actually, we are going to talk more about Terra Nova. Now, without further ado, let's get down to the table. Let me show you what the differences are between the versions and uh, then we'll talk some more about it. Okay, first stuff that uh, I can't compare because it's no longer in the game is uh, this track. Actually, it tracks those priests that go up these, uh, give you different rewards to turn these purple tokens in your three bowls and everything so yeah this is completely gone now from the game so uh, that aside uh, i'm going to show you now this thing versus this thing this is actually if you want to tra track your turns and if you want your play order to change depending who pass first now as you can see previously it was going all up to five now you are playing just four rounds so that's like the main difference uh, for uh, this uh, version of uh, Terra Nova, the newest one. So on the right side, of course, I'm gonna show you the new stuff and this is the old stuff. So let's move that aside. And now the races itself, the races are a little bit different. So uh, uh, previously they looked something like this. And now, for example, the blue one looks like this. Uh, as you can see, there is uh, way less uh, spaces to terraform difference. I think the, over here we had two, four, six, seven and now we only have five different ways uh, lanes to terraform uh, the layout is pretty similar if you ask me it's pretty much the same but as you can see some stuff are missing because these and these buildings are now completely gone you only have these uh, small bigger houses and the fortresses that will be here and will give you some sort of different uh, abilities and, and rewards also the workers are no longer here you will uh, pay everything with coins now everything you do you will do it you will terraform with coins you will no longer terraform with uh, you will terraform with shovels but you will not pay workers you will pay coins for them the abilities are a little bit different depending which side you are watching and of course these are also double-sided so uh, it's really silly to compare them uh, one by one because they have like a little bit of different abilities so I'm just going to show you the new ones and how they look. Uh, so we have the uh, fire sprites or on the other side uh, golems and we have inventors and uh, leprechauns on the other side. Now there's the green ones are now fairies and uh, druids and the yellow ones are uh, sun worshippers and on the other side we have a sand cats because what's the game without cats, right? So yeah. And as you can see, they all pretty much look the same uh, in a sense of the layout, but their abilities are a little bit different uh, from one another. And you, uh, in these bowls, you will use way less purple tokens now. Uh, not like super less, but obviously a little bit less than you were used in Terra Mystica. So this is the new version of the map. And this is for like a two player game. And over here is like the normal version for four players and uh, in a previous version of course there were way more way more lands that you could uh, cover and the map is a little bit bigger uh, the rounds tracking is on this side and uh, how the sc you score the towns and how you fund the towns and everything now all of that is down here and these uh, things that you can activate throughout the game are now on the side for the new map and uh, the layout is pretty much the similar as you can see but the map is smaller because there's a really few different uh, types that you can terraform uh, for the land and uh, now let's do the close-up let me just oops let me just bring the camera down a little bit just to show you now i'm not going to compare the wooden components basically they are the same thing so they are just the wooden components the shape is the same the size is a little bit different but uh, it's really pointless to compare them uh, in any capacity now you also have the new tiles to terraform and the old ones to terraform and as you can see the artwork is a little bit different but the size is if i'm not mistaken yeah pretty much the same 
So these are the old new woods and the old woods, and this is no longer, or I think this is the, the play like these uh, mountains that you can terraform, and this is the sand, this is the new one, the old one. Uh, these one are like uh, this type of terrain. I think there's no more frozen terrain because there is no expansion for uh, the new version, but yeah, those are the tiles. And these, tile, these tiles that you select your actions each turn are these. They are pretty much the same with a little bit of differences because uh, previously you would get workers, but now workers are no longer available in this version. So you get to uh, turn your uh, tokens in the bowls. I think uh, most of them are pretty similar, but when some differences occur now, these are not like, okay, so these are two the same ones. As you can see, these are completely identical. So, and this is the new one compared to the old one. And these are also completely identical, but then these are a little bit different because there is no more workers. So you will get some coins instead because you now pay everything with coins. But basically that's that. That's all the differences between Terra Mystica and Terra Nova. Okay, so that was Terra Nova compared to Terra Mystica. And uh, I must say, I was really pleasantly surprised how great Terra Nova is. So much so that I am said to say that I'm going to get rid of Terra Mystica. Now, the only reason is because I can't remember last time I played Terra Mystica in my club. Now, to be honest, there's a quite some amount of new people coming into the club. So I might pull it off, might play it with some of those new ones who don't know about the game. Because everyone else seems to hate it for some reason and I absolutely love it. But Terra Nova is much easier quicker version of Terra Mystica and I think that I can see it coming to the table way more often. The, the main difference that they did is they completely removed like the little workers. Uh, you now don't need workers, you now pay everything with gold, the terraforming and everything. There is, uh, I think, two less land types to terraform than in a base game, in a, no, in a Terra Mystica. I say base game like this is an expansion, like in Terra Mystica. And uh, everything is, there's completely that uh, track where you move your uh, like priests or whatever they are, that's completely gone from the game. Uh, there's n none of it. Uh, usually the towns uh, that you would found in the, in the game, you had like two tokens of all kinds of different uh, towns you could found. But now every player has the same exact tokens. You just decide which one you want to use. Do you want to go for the one that gives you like victory points or something else? It's really up to you. But overall, Terra Nova is masterfully done as, as in a sense, like it, as in a make it like a, a little lighter version of Terra Mystica. I see this coming to the table way more offer, often and the game is like super quick. It's insane how quick, how quick the turns are. You just go, I explained the game to everybody, everyone uh, who played it. Actually, two players were new players. Me and Slaven were like, we already knew about it. Uh, and... It was like this quick. It was just left and right. Turns were going around and it was done in an hour and something with two new players. That's absolutely astonishing. And it still keeps everything, all that feel of Terra Mystica, it still keeps in. So it's masterfully done. I wish that some other games that are like overly complex, I'm not saying that Terra Mystica is, but for some people, I wish that they would, if they do like an easier version, they would do it like Terra Nova absolutely phenomenally done game unfortunately i think terra mystica is going on sale uh, i still don't i will not be able to have some races or something but i just don't see the reason to keep it anymore because i don't play it and terra nova i will definitely play more so that's that that's all i have to say terra mystica is gone terra nova is the new terra mystica for me and uh, that is that. Thank you all for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for spending time with me. Do check out my Patreon down there in the uh, description of this video. You can, or at the end of this video, you can support this channel that way and decide what types of reviews you want to see or top five games lists, all kinds of different things that I put up on there for patrons to decide. And uh, yeah, that is that. Thank you all for watching and uh, until next time. Pozdrav. So that was Terra Nova compared to Terra Mystica and Terra Mystica to his newest sibling, little sister, younger sibling.